So far, the questions that have been asked are more related to manufacturers and um, uh, consequential impact on the traders who are buying goods within India. I'm from the fitness industry where most of the industry uh, is uh, based on import uh, of uh, goods. What happens in such cases? That is one question. Number two, related to the fin fitness industry is that um, the GST on fitness industry has been separated from sports goods, which does not make sense because both of them really should be falling in the same category. And fitness industry has been put in the highest bracket, consider considering it to be luxury. And that's something that really is... Which one? Well, Jim? His, his answer will be simple. Just do yoga instead. That will take care of fitness, right? <laughs> I know that's going to be his response. I know that's going to be his response. Yes, sir, go ahead. Well, uh, uh, let me answer to your first question. Whenever you are importing any goods into the country from 1st of July night, you would have to pay IGST along with the custom duty. So that is one thing. So IGST, the first GST income will happen to us at 12 o'clock in the midnight on 1st of, on 30th uh, June night. So that will be the first transaction of GST coming to us. So you will have to pay full IGST, the credit of which you can take when you have a liability to pay CGST and SGST when you are selling your output goods within the country. So that is how we will handle the import part of it. Right? Stock? Stock of goods that are lying either in bonded warehouses or our own warehouses where again the VAT has not been paid so far. On which IGST is not paid, no? no not at all. You see, only the only thing that has happened... No, if you have paid the CVD on it, yes. that CVD is going to be given uh, credit if you have got the vouchers for CVD payment. Right. So that will be given uh, credit off. So if the goods are cleared from customs, then CVD is paid and customs duty yeah. is paid. But what about goods that are lying in bonded warehouses, where neither CVD nor customs duty has been paid? Then when you take it out of bonded warehouse, you will have to pay custom duty as well as IGST. So it will be, it'll be deemed as if it has been imported? Absolutely, that on that date, yeah. Okay. So that is what you have to be careful about now.